Up fuel fund, and since 1981, they have been keeping families in our community warm by helping them pay their energy bills, help seniors, people with disabilities, families who barely make ends meet. And for five years, a local school, Maryvale, has been helping too. This morning, Mike Vogren, he's the Christian Service Coordinator at Maryvale, along with two wonderful students, Leslie and Teresa, join us this morning. Thanks so much for coming in. Thank you. All right, so how have you guys been helping out, and how does this work for people who aren't familiar with Maryvale's involvement? Well, I mean, we're so like fortunate to be going to a school like this, so anything we can do to help raise awareness and things. I mean, we have a coat and snuggy drive, um, the Lights Out event Friday at 7. So, With Lights so. Out event, what does that mean? Well, we pretty much um, stay in our school gym, and we have sleeping bags, and some people even bring tents, and we spend you know, the night without any electricity to help understand what these people are going through and w how important Fuel Fund is to these people. So why do something like this? What, what do you guys, what do you learn from it? Well, I mean, it's, it's different. It's a different, it's so fun. I mean, people come in, bring like sleeping bags, tents, and I mean, it's not a normal like sleepover for someone our age. Yeah. It's like no electronics, no Uncomfortable cell Uncomfortable maybe a little bit? I mean, but then we learn to have fun like with each other, yeah. talk, board games, so it's different, it's fun. And the bigger picture about raising awareness and helping out and really kind of thinking beyond yourself, do you get any sense of that? Yeah, it's defi that's definitely a big part of it where, as Leslie said, we are a privileged community. We go to a great school with great people. This is kind of our way of seeing that not everyone out there has the benefits that we do. We're, you know, we're lucky. We're not, you know, the majority of the people out there. How proud are you? It's our fifth year doing this, and I have to say the, the energy and enthusiasm that the girls have brought to this has been tremendous. We, we as a school couldn't be more proud. I mean, they, they not only raise awareness, but they raise money, and they get the kids excited about it. Uh, all of our students are excited. It's a household name, basically, at, at Maryville, the Fuel Fund. They know it. <laughs> so hopefully we'll, that'll translate into people uh, assisting um, other people in need. So we're very proud. You're selling cookies. You've got a Snuggie yep. drive. Tell us a little bit about that. And, and does it really kind of bring the school together with a great sense of community? Well, I mean, the Snuggie drive, it's and coats. I mean, it's really funny. We were, we, were, we were going through what we could do this year to make something different. I mean, every year it's a coat drive. And never, like, I mean, people were like, eh. But I was like, let's do something different. So Snuggie drive, um, I feel like people are more like into it, more fun. Um, so it's yeah. exciting. I'm okay. excited. They got one of our male <laughs> teachers to wear yeah. a snuggie to, to promote it. So oh, that, I like that, that. That's how much it is. That goes snuggie. a long way. And those yeah. snuggies are warm. I know. They are. <laughs> now, what about this? I know that you guys pointed this out the Watt Watchers. What exactly is that? And, and how is this involved with the whole thing? It's pretty much showing us how we can do little things in our lives to conserve energy, such as unplugging like your computer. You don't realize that even if your computer's turned off, that's still taking electricity if it's plugged in. You're still wasting it. Or even turning off the lights when you walk out of a room. How many times do we walk out of a room and just leave our lights on? Mm -hmm. Just small things that, yes, we Maryville girls don't pay the bill, but our parents do, and to make it easier on them. All right, Mike, are you taking them back to class? Uh, pretty soon. Pretty, pretty soon. soon. All right. Well, I'm sure they're excited. If somebody <laughs> wants to get involved, if they want to learn more, is there a website they can go to or a number they can call or anything? Um, Fuel Fund of Maryland, I think it's, it, it is on here. Fuel, yes. Fuel Fund of Maryland. Maryland dot org. Dot org. So, All right. Yeah. Well, you guys are amazing. You're going to be running the world someday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming in. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you for having us. All right. We'll see you next year, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Absolutely. All right. Absolutely.